Yo, what's up guys? Quick update on um, Solana. As you can see, we did not manage to hold the support area right here at about um, $196. You can see it right here, guys. We did manage to hold it for about um, yeah one day actually or so. And right now we are breaking down. We retested the support area as a new resistance. And right now we are currently down from this support area about 7 to 10% actually and it seems like we are still finding some support right here around $173 you can see it from the past price section guys this area around $173 was a very significant resistance and support zone for Solana first of all you can see it right here guys in this first run up in September it was acting as a huge support right here and since we broke down it was acting uh, here for about a couple of times uh, actually as a, a huge resistance and that's why I think we are currently finding and Solana is still respecting this area right here as a very huge support area. I think the worst case that can, that could happen right now for Solana is if we are closing some candles below the support area this would be at approximately 172 to about 166 dollars maybe and then um I think we could maybe go down and then then the next layer of um, support, the next demand zone would be at approximately $152 actually. You can see it right here also from the past price action guys. This area around $150, $152 was also a very significant so uh, zone for Solana. And yeah, um, this is definitely, this would be the case in my opinion, like I said, if we are not able to hold this support area right here at around $173 and we are closing some candles down below it and we will see a confirmed breakdown towards the downside, then we could maybe see another sell off in my opinion of about 15%. This would be the worst case scenario, like I said, guys, and otherwise... If we are able to hold up right now, it also depends what Bitcoin is doing, guys. Don't forget that. Also, always take a look what Bitcoin is doing because I think if Bitcoin continue to go down in the next hours, let's say to about 44, 45k, then I think Solana will definitely follow. And otherwise, we have definitely to take out right now this area right here at around $195, guys. You can see it very clear that we have above $195. Definitely a lot of resistance. A lot of backholders are currently sitting in this area. And this is definitely the range I will take a look at right now. And I think if we are able to take it out successfully and we are closing some candles above $195, so I would say between $200 to about $196 right here in this range, then I would definitely take a look for a squeeze back to about this layer of resistance around $205, guys. This would be the next range I would take a look at if we are able to hold right now the support area and if we will approach again to this area around $195, guys. And that's basically it. I'm just keeping it simple right now. Like I said, um, I'm watching... If you're able to hold the support area in the next four to eight hours, I'm definitely expecting a huge bounce from Solana to about $195. And like I also said, don't forget what um, to have a close look always what Bitcoin is doing because Bitcoin is currently leading all the altcoins and that's why you want always to take a look what Bitcoin is doing in the next one or two days. I will definitely keep you updated maybe in about eight hours or so on Solana, guys. If you're enjoying these type of videos, please drop a like, subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, guys, just comment down below and I hope I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.